myself from Ash Park. I'm my partner. I'm going to explain this. Josh Dick for visual impact. I saw a lot lots of people and a blind man standing in the street. He is hesitating to cross the road and no one around him was helping him. And I too can't help him and not just staring at him. This incident made me feel guilty. So the next day I discussed this incident with my friend Ashpak. So we this idea sparked in our mind that we could help them. So we could find a device that could help them. So while we searched on the internet, to our surprise we couldn't find any device that could help them. So we decided to uh, create the system ourselves. So here we are with the joystick for visually impaired. The system basically has two devices. The first one is the object detecting lock gate that detects anything in front of them. And the second one is a joystick that tracks a signal from the traffic signal. This joystick is basically working on our radio frequency. This has an RF receiver and we are going to use an RF transmitter. This RF transmitter is going to be with a policeman. When, yeah, when there is a red light, the blind person uh, doesn't give any signal because the vehicle should stop here and so that you could cross the road. But when there is a window light, the blind person will get a vibration signal here. You can touch and see that. Yeah. We are basically asking him to be ready here. And when there is a green light, you will get a uh, buzzer sound here. So we are alerting them when to cross the road. And uh, let's say he has crossed the road now. Now, it is not guaranteed that he will not bump into anyone or collide into anyone or anything or uh, even a dog. They may, it may be there. Uh, so that we have prepared this, this basically has an uh, ultrasonic sensor which senses anything in front of them and gives the output as a buzzer. If the distance between the person and the object is low, then the sound of the sensor increases. Now let's see it's working. When there is no one in front of me, the sensor does not direct anything. As I go in front, it starts writing. If I go more front towards the person, the direction increases. If I get close enough, the relation will be moving forever. We are basically liberating the blind people here. We want them to be liberated and when they go out, they should not be dependent on anyone. This is our motive here. In the world, there are around 40 million people who are blind. In that, 18.7 million people are from India. This is why India is called the blind capital of the world. So if this system was implemented in India, India will become the home for the blind people. This system will revolutionize the lives of blind people because they do deserve to live a normal and independent life like us. For our future enhancement, we are going to use the uh, space shuttle sensors used by Dr. APJ Abdulka. This sensor would be more effective than this. We have even published a journal with a patent there. I have published this journal. If you just Google, you will get the first link here. This is with my name. And I have published this with a pattern. Thank you.